Hey guys, Patton here. Welcome back to Will It Run on the SNES Classic. So again, we have another double feature requested by Peter James Ledwith. He wants to know if Rostan and Salamander will run on the SNES Classic. So let's give them a shot. First thing you need to do is download those ROMs. I'll help you out with that in a minute. So once you got those ROMs downloaded, you're going to hit Add More Games. All right, so we got Rastan, Rastan. I don't know how to pronounce it. I've never played the game. I don't know anything about it, except that we're trying to get it to run here. So, Rastan, Rastan. So you want R-A-S-T-A-N-A. -A. I believe it's the world version. That's what you want. So just do a search for Rastan World uh, Arcade ROM, something like that, and it should pop up for you. So Rastan World. What was the other one? Salamander. Salamand J. So as you can tell, this is Salamander Japanese version. If you do a search for this, Arcade ROM, that will work for you. S-A-L-A-M-A-N-D-J. Salamand J. All right, let's add these to the SNES Classic. Here's our files. Import as archive for both. Ironically, in the last episode, we needed both cores to get each of the games to run and we have to do that again today. No problem, we know how to do that. We are experts at adding arcade games to the SNES Classic at this point. Alright, so first thing though, we need some box art. Salamander. Let's get some box art for the Salamander. Salamander Arcade Google box art. What do we got? I'm gonna say all these look really good, except for that one. That has nothing to do with this. That is Life Force for Nintendo. Nonsense. We want this one. This one looks cool. Salamander. Got it. What was the other one? Rastan. Let's do Rastan Arcade. Google that box art. This is some badass box art. All of these. Wow. This dude is kind of like Conan. It just keeps getting... What is? Look at this. Lizard fighting. Goddesses. Stone goddesses, but still... All this is great. I don't know which one to pick. This one. We'll go for that one. I don't know. I changed my mind. I need this one. We need this. With bare butt. Don't ignore the bare butt. Okay. Whatever. I'm getting distracted by bare butt. All right. Got our uh, box art. Now we have to install the modules. In the description, you'll see a download link for some arcade cores. Go ahead and download that. Go up to modules, install extra modules. So in the zip file that I provided, you'll see the arcade cores. You're going to want to drag over the FB Alpha 2012 and the MAME 2010. If you want both of these to work, you have to install both of those cores. So you drag them over, you check these boxes here, then you hit OK. A, uh, a box will pop up saying to hold down the reset button as you power on the Super Nintendo Classic. So you go ahead and do that. You hold the reset button down, power it on. After a few seconds, a bar is going to pop up. It's going to start filling up green. That's installing the modules to your SNES Classic. Once that's done, you hit OK. And we're going to be almost finished. We have to change the command line here to get these games to run with the cores provided. So Rastan. Rastin. I don't know. I'm going to call him Rastan because I think that sounds better. FBA 2012. You're going to see slash bin slash zip. Replace the zip with FBA 2012. And that is for Rastan. For Salamander, you're going to change the zip to MAME 2010. So, we made everything go away. Here we are. Box art, got our modules installed. All that's left is to synchronize the games to the SNES Classic. And we're done. Look at this. Barely took any space at all. These wonderful arcade games. I love it when they're small. Okay. We're all set. Uh, let's go over to the SNES Classic and see how they look. Yes, I know. Batman and Robocop are still here. Would you get rid of them if you had the choice? I wouldn't. And I didn't. That's why they're still here. So anyway, Rastan Arcade... Salamander Arcade. Yeah, we got the little screen zip because we don't have enough games on the on the uh, home screen, but that's okay. So, Salamander I'm kind of familiar with because I played the um, 
what games are these? It's uh, that shooter, Gradius. Yes, it's from the Gradius family. Look at that. Starts right up. MAME 2010. Make sure you're using that core. Well, it's kind of starting up. Okay, there we go. I remember getting to this spot, and I'm like, okay, I think we're good. So here we are, Salamander. We're going to please deposit coin. Coinami, or Kionami? I don't know. We want all the credits, because this is a hard game, I bet. If it's anything like Gradius. Okay, none of the buttons. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we can shoot with A. We've got options already. Perfect. A shoots. All we're getting is a bunch of options. Guns, maybe? I don't know. This is a lot different than Gradius, actually. Gradius, you can pick your power-ups here. You can't. Oh, okay. B shoots missiles. We got the missiles. We got more options right from the get-go. Seems to be playing good. We're not very fast, though. Can you get speed power-ups, I hope? Because you kind of need that. We're already feeling kind of powerful. We got four options. We got lasers. Taking down these creepy crawlies that just keep growing. Got a lot of missiles. We got a little thing on the front of our nose that will take care of anything in front of us. Yeah, there we go. Got it. Still got four, four options. Oh, missiles for these guys, definitely. Another gun. Missed it. Another option does nothing. Oh, no. Sounds pretty good. Sounds like a shooter. Sounds like a Konami shooter. Oh boy. Oh, what are what spikes? Wall sp no. These are gross. What is that? Oh, speed up. Sweet. There we go. That's what I needed. More speed. Yes. Oh, we got some slowdown, I think. I think we got some slowdown. Maybe we're going too fast. I can't get through there. We made it through. I feel like that shouldn't have worked. <laughs> I feel like I just jipped the game out. Oh, what is going on here? Kill all this, please. We need to make it through. Oh, I remember this from Gradius. And, oh. Oh, we're right here, though. Okay, it's not like, you know, just skip all these. Can we? I have I have nothing but a pea shooter now. That is not going to work. But we're doing okay with the pea shooter. Oh, and spitting talons. Oh, there's no way. Yeah, might as well just take the hit there because... Look at this. Oh, rapid fire. It's coming back behind me. I don't like that. Ugh. We're doing it. Oh, that was hard. Oh, okay. Oh, boss. Salamander boss. Is it a brain? It's a brain. Brain coral. Or just an angry, angry brain. Nope, that is not coral. That's just angry brain with a hand that I can't shoot. Maybe I can shoot it, and it's just... Or is this just really starting slow? Oh, okay, we're going to go back here. You can't see me, brain. I see that eyeball popping out, but you still can't get me. I'm going to shoot you in the eye. I'm not going to shoot you in the eye. Instead, I'm going to run away from your gross hands. I can't even tell if I'm hurting them. I have no, no real weapons. I'm not enjoying this boss fight because I... Okay, let's try again. Get him right in the eye. Oh! Oh, look at this. We're going we're going vertical. What? This is different. You don't do this in Gradius. More coins. Oh, hello. This is starting to feel like Galaxian. And, yep, I saw that coming because we're so slow. You really need to keep your power-ups, man. You cannot... I don't think... This is really cool, though. I wasn't expecting vertical shooter out of nowhere. All right, we have another game to play. I'm getting... Again, I get distracted easy when I'm enjoying myself. Salamander, Robocop? No, Rastan. Let's see what kind of game this is. Taito, that started up super quick. That is a regal, a regal gentleman. Is that us? Are we him? Is that Rastan? We don't look like him. We don't have gray hair. Okay, we can jump and slash. And move and slash. Oh, a fast move. We can oh, up slash and down slash. Jump slash. Wait, this reminds me of something. This is like really close to something, or that game is a an homage to this. It has to be, what is that, Volgar or something for the PC? Oh, now we have an axe. This reminds me of Volgar. Can I throw spears? 
That was a cool game. I never got to play through that either. This is just like that game. Olgar. Look that game up if you've never played it. Oh! Apparently that was water and not just background. Okay, we're back at the beginning, but that's okay because this runs really, really smooth. I just got smacked with a club by a lizard. This is just as intense. We got a little duck down attack. Just as intense as uh, the box art leads you to believe it is. This is immensely manly, and we died. Not an easy game, apparently. But that's okay. Not all arcade games were easy back then. Let's get some more quarters, just in case. We want to try and get a little further. And the down. There we go. You coming down here? Nope. Alright, the bat messed me up last time. We want to try and avoid the bat. I guess it doesn't matter. Oh. To continue game. We have to. Look at him. He's so angry that we barely got anywhere. Let's try again. I wonder if I have to collect those crystals, if it means anything, I don't know. It's an interesting life bar down there. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh that's right, we can poke up. Come on, bats. Run into this sword of death. Gotcha. Okay, let's get this one. Axe. But we died. Are we gonna try to avoid the axe this time? I don't know what those bars mean down there. If I have like a Okay, the yellow bar is my health. We'll avoid the axe for now, just to make progress. Oh, did the sky just change colors? Okay, don't fall into water this time. This is solid. What are these? Ganeshes? Skeleton Ganeshes? The Indian Goddess? I probably have that all wrong, I have no idea what I'm even talking about. You shouldn't listen to me half the time. When I'm telling you what, what core to use, listen to me then, but when I'm playing a game, you shouldn't listen to me because I, I, I obviously have no idea what I'm talking about. Do we get a, a midpoint? We do. Halfway checkpoint. Let's go up this, this rope. I didn't see what that new enemy was, but apparently our sword did. Oh, and we could have swung up there. That's okay. Ooh. Oh, it's a chimera! And rocks! New enemy, the rock! What is it cooking? I don't know. I'm, I'm not I'm not his friend, really. What does that do? I'm gonna use it. Use it right here. I don't know how to use it! Well, we collected it, but we didn't use it. So that's Rostan. That actually was a lot of fun. I'm just not very good at it. Need some practice. So there you go. <clears throat> Rostan Arcade, Salamander Arcade, wonderful, fun games, and they both run. MAME 2010 core for Salamander, FBA 2012 for Rostan. So thank you so much for requesting this game. Who was that? I, I forgot your name already. I apologize. Peter James Ledwith. I did write it down. I just couldn't find my piece of paper. Peter James Ledwith. Thank you so much for recommending these. Both very cool games. I'm going to try them out when I have some time. If you have any requests, feel free to leave them in the comments or on my Twitter. <coughs> Excuse me. Or uh, you can email me. So thank you for, for uh, watching. And I will see you guys next time. So if you guys want to get in touch with me outside of the YouTube comments, you can feel free to follow my Twitter at Pat and Place. Or if you have any questions, uh, you can email me at my Gmail account, patentplaysgames at gmail.com. Thanks again for watching the video, and I'll see you guys next time.